Shalom. All right, first and foremost, I like to give all praises to Yahweh, Basham Yahushai, Basham Rakakodash, and double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. It's real well. And peace and blessings to the elect. Um, this year is Amma One from the Great Millstone Camp in Trinidad. Coming back again to do another lesson. Through the Holy Spirit and power of Yahweh, Basham Yahushai, Basham Rakakodash, and um, yeah, we um, and just a lesson basically listening to the people and the cries of the people in the world, you know, that you know, they just want things, they want things to return back to normal, all right, they want this whole <coughs> coronavirus. Um, scare um, it's, just, it's just a myth you know this whole thing is about bringing about a new system that what this whole COVID-19 thing is about to bring about a new system the scripture say what um, the wiles of the devil the scripture says surely we are not ignorant of satan's devices and this whole thing is about bringing about a new way of life well a new system for the edomites because the edomites which are the so-called white people getting ready to <coughs> getting ready to advance into the new world order and this second corinthians chapter 2 verse 11 it says let's Satan should get an advantage of us for we are not ignorant <coughs> of his devices all right and the ones who are not ignorant of Satan's devices are the ones who whose eyes are anointed with eye self that they will see okay the Heavenly Father give us that understanding and that privilege to know what this so-called white man coming with we in he mind right now. <laughs> we living in he head. And he <laughs> that's that's saying don't you know, you know. When somebody conquer in you. Yeah, we living in he saw it. <coughs> so like, we living in he head. No nevertheless, people talking about the one thing to return. I just want to I just want to see things go back to normal. That is all I hear. I just want to see things go back to normal. As do we. I, I don't want to see things go back to normal. But it are two different classifications of normal for people. See, normal for them is where they could get up and frolic themselves and go to work and, and commit adultery. And, 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 and homosexuals could walk the road <coughs> but once they're disturbing them um, them in the little corner living the life and getting to go to work and make the salary free and when they feel to go and party and go on a boat ride uh, and eat chicken and eat KFC and live and enjoy life that is their normal that is their normal see our normal is supposed to be the laws of the Heavenly Father. We want our society to see righteousness constantly being done on the face of the earth. That is normal for we. That is what we want to see. That is what we want to be normal. That is what is supposed to be the norm. You see? The norm not supposed to be sinning and wickedness. The norm is supposed to be righteousness. So we want to see things go back to normal. So that's why we pray and beg the Heavenly Father to because it's, it don't reach it don't reach here already, it don't reach any point of people being indoors. Why should it why should society start back to function norm um so so called quote unquote normal according to the ways of the system where people back out and, and frolic because if if that the case you know what are going on say you no know, you know what Christians going and say? Christians going and say Jesus do it. You know? 
And they're going on fucking Sam to praise and serve the fake gods and all kind of thing. I pray the Heavenly Father keep this thing going on and, and let Esau let Esau do what he had to do, you know? So that we could be in a normal society which is the laws of the Heavenly Father being perpetuated on the face of the earth by the true rulers of the earth, which is the Hebrew Israelites, which consists of the so-called Negroes, the so-called Latinos, the so-called Native American Indians. See? The, the, that would be, that is the norm we want. Because everybody talking about, I want to see things go back to normal. Why is it why is it, why is it normal? Why is them normal, boy? And I get me real vexed, boy. Why is it normal? Your normal is if you can be able to go to work and, 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 and just be in a corner and see one set of wickedness going on on the face of the earth. He's playing programs on TV that could teach your own children to be homosexuals, boy. That wicked act, boy. That is a wicked act, boy. That is the normal you want, boy. Programs on your children, tablet and all kind of thing that could teach your children to be homos, boy. And lesbians, boy. Telling your child if you want to cut off your own penis and change his sex at the age of seven, he could do that. And the parents had to be uh, uh, by, uh, understanding to that because that is the child decision, boy. That is the normal you want. No, we a society like that had to collapse. That is not normal, right? That is not normal for no society, right? That is abnormal. That is immoral and that is absurd for the for our world to be running like that. Normal had to be the head, the heavenly father laws, right? That is what that is what had to be norm. That is what had to be norm. So you want to see things go back to normal? I say, may our Basha, may our Shai, destroy this place. See? No, I'm gonna get an excuse every day. I want to see things go back to normal. Get me real vexed, I should be talking. You sure? He saw that now everybody in a corner already. I want you to fulfill his heart's desire. You don't have them. You don't have them there. You don't have them in the corner. You know what I'm You don't have them in the corner. Um, this is Isaiah 28 and verse. Night 14, it says I will highlight it because I want to like to highlight my former verses on them. Isaiah 28 and 14, it says, Wherefore, hear the word of Yahweh, ye scornful men that rule this people which is in Jerusalem. <coughs> because ye have said, We have made a covenant with death, and with hell are we at, at agreement. All right. That is basically, that is the leaders, that is your pastors, your, your prime ministers and what not. And um, the scripture says in, in the Apocrypha, as the judge of the people is, as uh, um, the ruler of the people, as so are all the people that dwell, dwell there in, that is in Sirach chapter 10. Let me see if I could get it. Sirach chapter 10 and we have verse 5. Let's know. It says, An unwise king. Let's know. Oh, no, verse. Sirach 10 and verse 2. It says, As the judge of the people is himself, so are his officers. And what manner of 
man the ruler of the city is such are all they that dwell therein so now let me go back to the book of um, Isaiah 28 and, and verse 14 it says wherefore hear the word of Yahweh you scornful men that rule this people which is in Jerusalem so what manner a ruler you have the people is like that and we have a bunch of wicked rulers see Dr. Keith Rowley supposed to be ruler of um, um of Trinidad and Tobago which he isn't but he's a wicked man and Kamala Posad Bissessa all you coolies all you East Indians all are you East Indians ah boy the day the day <laughs> all you heathen man you like to pull your hand on Israelites you see when you, when you feel the Israelites is the scum of the earth and the father letting you jakes wake up all you had to wake up by your list you know, and see these people don't like all you right? they don't like all you right? wake up by right? so pretending to like them they don't like you if them don't like you you don't like them hell nobody has them going just because you have said we have made a covenant with death and with hell are we at agreement and that is basically Esau see all you jakes all your, because all your leaders link with Esau all your link with Esau same way so all your like what Esau does give all your you know son that is all your normal all your normal is Esau kingdom and he gives scripture say what a gift destroyed the heart a gift that destroy the mind a gift okay it says when the overflowing scourge shall pass through it shall not come unto us because when you're telling on yourself things going and go back to normal you know is that, that overflowing scourge that overflowing scourge done prepared already so this is why he's saying this is why he's saying why should things go back to quote unquote normal according to all you all you normal now a new system had to be put in place virgin because all you just want to still see bullets by so by the wickedest thing by He's not telling you train on them they they alright and they okay if they want to be a homo by what the fuck is that right? Giving the woman rights over your trend, giving the woman rights over you, your, your money where you work hard for them could come and take it. What what is that by it's all you have that is a wicked system by that by I don't know right just place by that evil by the evil you're doing to man by you know son that is normal and not normal by like damn demonic activity by it says um and the overflowing skirts is what unprepared you see all them you see how they are the threatening here and He's all right now, talking like a dragon, like a freaking dragon, as the scripture says. Um, he had two horns as a lamb, and he speak as a dragon. He talking like a dragon. Eh? He ain't how he talk. I listen to one of the ministers on the radio the other day, and hear the man now. Why the man talking about? <coughs> oh, he's so disappointed in people who go and 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 he talking in a stern way. I'm very disappointed in that. Like, like, easy chair and I like, what the frig am to you, bro? You, you make me up. And this is how them going and come. Them going and come with austere measures. Them going and bring in the martial law. And that is the overflowing scourge. And the done start. So why should it go back to normal? What are you all you thinking? Because when the overflowing scourge shall pass through, it shall not come unto us. For we have made lies of our refuge, and under falsehood have we ourselves 
Therefore, thus said the Lord Power, Behold, I lay in Zion a foy foundation, which is Yahweh Shai. A stone. That is the foundation, it says right in and I'm full screen, John chapter 3. Let's see. I'm going to get out of here quick, bam, and then come back there. Full screen, John 3 and 11. No, no, no. What's Ephesians? Full screen, John chapter 3 and verse 11. It says, For other foundation can no man lay than that is laid, which is Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. Alright, so now it says, Verse 17. No, no, verse 16. It says, Therefore, thus said the Lord Power, behold, I lay in Zion. For a foundation, a stone, a tried stone, a precious cornerstone, a sure foundation, he that believeth shall not make haste. Judgment also will I lay to the line, and righteousness to the plummet. And the hail shall sweep away the refuge of lies because our refuge is our place of shelter. Like a refugee camp. So all you shelter all yourself with each one you freaking lies. But that is not a sure foundation because you have a going on. The scripture say the name of the Lord is a strong tower and the righteous run into that and is safe. And the name of the Lord have no lies in it. The Father is not a man that he should what? Lie. Ah. So all you, all you get twisted. All you want to I don't understand why the fuck Jake so hard headed, but that you how the father make all you you know all you real hard headed by he so hard to fall along with the hell what 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 all you what is man to rule so for? What is man doing so good by? All you want to see bullers, homosexuals just keep up and down and up and down, running up on all your face? That is what you want to see. That is the normal all you want. What about a society where righteousness just ruling right through? Let me give you an example. What about a society for you men where you don't even have to, where a woman have no rights to go before the court and put you in court for minding your child, right? Or put you in court and tell you pay child support. Or put you in court and tell you stay away from your child. What about a society like that? She have no rights to do that. What about a society where she could never leave you or commit adultery? What about a society where brother one genuinely love brothers? What I mean? What I have, you have. What you have, I have. A genuine brotherhood society. What about that, right? What about a society where true love? Yeah, that they're listening to a song. And in the song, you know the man singing, the man singing, the most I made man with love by meaning in the creation process is love the father was making, he, he put love in it, in the creation of man, and you could, you could see that, how, how man make, the structure of man, and everything the father make, he, he made it with love, it have a, it have a thing, it have a thing where Alright, like in a trade, if he's a trade man. And you're doing a trade with love on it, with love on, with love in it and, and with with with, with uh, passion. The 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 work that you bring forth there's be more it could it could be clearly seen that yeah boy this man do this thing with, with, with zeal boy rather than you just do it halfway. It could be clearly seen. And it's clear to see the father make man with love by with with, with a finesse with the, with the creation and, and you have this Edomite just come and just freaking up the whole place. You understand? So so wait is you that is the normal you want? We talking about a society where things going and flow back how it's supposed to be, rivers going and be clean, air going and be clean. The animals going to be clean. See? Food going to be healthy and nutritious. Women's mind going to be clean. Men's mind going to be clean. No more 
murder any your own brother for nothing this is the society we speak of that is what we want to see as normal that should be the norm in our society that I hope the Heavenly Father don't let things return back to so-called normal until a society like that is established on the face of the earth. You see? It says, and the water shall overflow the hiding place, which is the truth. Because they like to hide behind lies, but they basically these Edomites on them. Lord consuming him with the spirit of his mouth. Right, verse, verse 18 says, And your covenant with death shall be dishonored, and your agreement with hell shall not stand. When the overflowing scourge shall pass through, then ye shall be trodden down by it. Can. Hey, verse, verse 19 and 20. Let me read them things. Them is things to read. This verse 19. It says, From the time that it goeth forth, it shall take you. It says, From morning by morning, it shall pass over by day and by night. And it shall be a vexation only to understand the report. For the bed is shorter than that a man can stretch himself on it, and the covering narrower than that he can wrap himself in it. And that is what that is how the society is. Uncomfortable, please, but you don't have no proper security and proper rest. If you sleep on a bed was shorter than, than you, you can go and sleep properly and if you're wrapping up yourself in a cover that not covering you properly, you're, go, you're always going to be cold and in your sleep you can go and sleep properly if you're cold you're not warm so it's just uncomfortable, you know, this is the society you want to live in, an uncomfortable society, we want to live in a society where it's comfort all around, peace, eternity true judgment if wickedness be done it should be corrected at that moment and that should be normal you know so I hope the Heavenly Father don't let things return back to so called normal until he saw bring about the RFID microchip because we, we, because right after that, so I hope the Heavenly Father used this to make his sovereign out the right RFID microchip. Because people go had to use the chip, but it didn't go and take long. You understand? Know, it didn't go and take no 15 years. Because right after that chip being made mandatory, is when the Heavenly Father went to speed things up real quick and deliver the people. Uh, son. So I hope the Heavenly Father make this sort of push this thing to the limit the way he bring out the mar mark of the beast RFID microchip. Not to let it return back to normal and then bring that situation. No, bring it now, Baba Kosha. Um, Yahweh Basham, Yahweh because it's ultimately the Father. You know? So yeah, we'll do that and I'll give all praise to say how about Sham Yao Shai Ba Shamaka Kodash double honor to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone that rule well and peace and blessings to the elect. This is Amawan signing out, Shalom.